measuring ROI using conversion tracking. Once you've set up conversion tracking, new columns including conversion rate and cost per conversion will appear in your campaign summary page at the ad group level and keyword level. If you sell different products online, you can manually set up different values for these conversions or have your shopping cart do it for you. To track the ROI for each of your keywords, ad groups or campaigns, you can run a keyword performance report or campaign performance report. Be sure to select value over cost and value over click, making value over cost the measure of ROI and value over click equal to how much each click is worth to you. Value is the amount you defined when setting up conversion tracking. After running a keyword performance report, you can sort your results by value over cost or ROI and use the value over click information to guide your bids to improve the performance of your account. For high ROI keywords, you can increase the maximum CPC to the highest amount you are willing to pay per click and still make money. For low ROI keywords, on the other hand, you may want to consider decreasing your maximum CPC or removing these keywords from your campaign altogether. However, before removing these low ROI keywords, do keep in mind that keywords like flowers and chocolates often target potential customers earlier in the buying cycle and these same customers may visit your site later on to make a purchase. In other words, lower ROI keywords can work in combination with higher ROI keywords, such as buy red roses and chocolate gifts to generate a conversion 